I already applied my moisturizer uh, eye cream and everything and I'm gonna use Estee Lauder double wear foundation this is intensity one and I'm gonna use with Sigma flat kabuki F80 brush I find this brush works really really good with this product and buff that out I don't need too much coverage because of that I'm gonna put it in one layer next is Yves Saint Laurent this is touch clad I'm gonna use that right up here a little bit I wanted to use this first then on top of that apply concealer I'm using Sigma Precision Taped P86 which is kind of a round brush and kind of blend that this doesn't have too much coverage because of that I use it first then apply my concealer next to concealer I use Healthy Mix by Bourjois this is in 51 which is the lighter shade and I'm gonna apply that right under my eyes eye base I use Essence I Love Stage Eyeshadow Base which looks like this this is kind of concealer it's like skin color you see and I'm using concealer brush by Sigma which is F70 to blend this out I love this brush this is concealer brush but I really like it for eyeshadow base this eyeshadow base it's very good because dries very very quickly and it's kind of good for everybody who have very oily lids And apply just a little bit under the eye which is left on the brush first eyeshadow which I'm gonna use is by L'Oreal infallible eyeshadows this is forever pink gorgeous eyeshadow looks like this and with eyeshadow brush with E55 I'm gonna apply that right here I love this eyeshadow it's just incredible apply on your eyelid and just a little bit bring to your crease next eyeshadow which I'm gonna use it's expensive pink by MAC which is kind of similar but not that shimmery this is like orangey pinkish with so much gold reflex inside and it's my favorite eyeshadow and I'm gonna use that with E25 And put into my crease all over it this is the kind of the similar eyeshadow but more like golden tone apply it in your crease like this and take a blending brush and blend the edges to everything be smooth to create invisible line now I'm gonna mix two colors to create a very very beautiful golden brownish color because I don't have too much browns I'm gonna mix this deep brown with this very golden electric eyeshadow 
and I'm gonna take with the this is the same brush which I use E52 and kind of mix together and put into the crease then go with the eyeshadow brush and mix this and blend this out very very good now I'm gonna take my jumbo pencil in milk I'm gonna put that under my brow bone and in the corner right here and a little bit down you can use this on the start but I like it more in this way kind of in the end to see where I go, I'm going to put this and kind of blend that but not blend too much into the colors down just a little bit On top of that, I'm gonna use vanilla eyeshadow with this big eyeshadow brush. This is E60. I love this brush for highlight. I really now I put pure white pigment just into the corner this is going to open your eyes and make it beautiful and for spring definitely you won't kind of pop out the color also you can use it like this and make it your line like you want but definitely i will gonna go with this radiate number three purple this is artistic liner it's long lasting eyeliner and goes like this it's very very beautiful uh, purplish kind of marker um, liner and I'm gonna line that my eyes I really really love this eyeliner I must go and buy more of this because it's kind of incredible and now go for the pop up the colors more also you can use like this and if it's enough for you go but I'm gonna use uh, rocket yellow pigment by MAC and with pencil brush E30 I'm gonna put that on my bottom but next step is purple eyeshadow I use this multi effect eyeshadow wet and dry by Manhattan and it's 33 violet it's super super vibrant violet color but you can use it with everything you want this you can use wet and dry Today I'm going to use wet. With the pencil brush I'm going to put just right here and continue it with the liner. Okay, I already apply um, 
NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk in my waterline. This works really really good in the waterline. And one coat of maybe Linda Falsies Volume Express. This is dr uh, Black Drama. I really love this um, uh, mascara because it's super super black and makes the very spider lashes. I'm gonna use first uh, Refined Golden by MAC. And I find works really really good with a small contour F05 brush which looks like this. I love this brush for contouring. You see? And blends really really good which is very very good deal for that. First apply I don't blend. For my blush today I'm gonna use MAC Sambascu which is beautiful like brownish uh, orangey color with Sigma Large Angle Contour Brush F40 just a little bit because this is so dark for me I use it most of the time if I need uh, shimmery bronzer because this is so shimmery you can see it really really pretty shimmery color blend that well well this is so shimmery definitely very shimmery uh, blush and on top of that for highlight I'm gonna use gosh this is golden dust uh, face and body shimmer powder and I love this stuff this it's amazing no matter it's for body or for face gives very very unique kind of shimmer on it you see I really really love this stuff just a little bit this goes all over it this is by Essence, it's soft pink, my favorite. This is more like nude color. Okie dokie, and go. This uh, this lipstick is so so moisturizing, so so beautiful. I really really love this one, and it's so creamy, so pigmented. It's the gorgeous color ever seen. I think I don't have it the same color. Okie dokie, and for the lip gloss, I'm gonna use MAC Dazzle Gloss in Stepping Out. This is so shimmery. Again, because I really don't want to have my lips with lipstick and lip gloss and this is my first spring uh, tutorial it's very very with colorful but also you can use it like every day every day because it's not very bright colors except the eyeliner and just a little bit yellow underneath the lips are so so beautiful and thanks for watching keep comment down below like and subscribe and see ya